what's up guys my name is Amish Mahind and welcome back to another video so Activision had a call um, it was a um, Q4 earning call and they talked about about their game sellings how their games is going on how they're going uh, how their games is selling it's all it was all about that and Activision's uh, flagship game is Call of Duty so they talked a little bit more about uh, about Call of Duty's uh, current uh, title and the previous title uh, last year's title and they said basically um, it, it, this is um, a Twitter from Charlie Nickel that uh, Activision says Call of Duty 2017 will take Call of Duty back to its roots so that means that Call of Duty 2017 will be boots on the ground um, first person shooter of course and will be between um, World War II, Vietnam and modern settings this is how Call of Duty is all about and it's not so it's not futuristic anymore and thank god we are not going to see futuristic uh, card anymore so everybody is happy from now and this is a big uh, hint like a big teaser for next card and they said uh, also that Black Ops 3 set all time records add on revenue Activision had over 50 million active users in 2016 across all titles so Black Ops 3 digital content lead to record active users for 2017 and that means a lot so Black Ops 3 it's a uh, it's a good game you know even though it's futuristic so sales underperform it's clear that space setting just didn't resonate so Activision on Infinite Warfare so they admitted that Infinite Warfare was not the success that we planned so mm, it's not uh, they actually realized that so and that means that traditional combat for Call of Duty 2017 will be like boots on the ground as I told you so that's me the comment so and slash of my games confirmed and 2000 as 2017 developer so we knew it about that but they confirmed and we are honored and excited to bring this year's call of duty to fans everywhere so this is um slash German games uh, saying that and this is michael conray so proud of the work this team has been doing for the past two and more years we can wait to share more and we will be supporting more and more for Remaster, Infinite Warfare and Black Ops 3 with new content in 2017. So Black Ops 3 will have new content in 2017 and Activision made it clear that they had our feedback on setting, space setting didn't resonate with majority of community. Activision expects lower revenue in first half 2017 because Infinite Warfare content sales one match with Black Ops 3 last year. You know that Black Ops 3 it's a really successful game even though it's futuristic but Infinite Warfare is like the problem is the game doesn't look good like you see Black Ops 3 it's very it's very colorful it's so good to see it looks so good the uh, maps everything and Infinite Warfare the the game itself is like it didn't feel so good the color is like black, black and white gray and stuff like that and the game it's all a, the game has a lot of uh, energy weapons than a, like a, um, bullet um, weapons so that's why I don't like it and they have a lot of um, instead of making new weapons they are adding new uh, uh, like more weapon variety variants so that's why I don't like it and you know the last Call of Duty boots on the ground was a Call of Duty Ghost uh, even though that was the last Call of Duty uh, as a boots on the ground that didn't make um, well and I hope that the next Call of Duty 2017 will be boots on the ground it's confirmed so I hope that if they make a uh, boots on the ground Call of Duty, but it's not an if anymore. So I hope they uh, make a game like good, not not like Call of Duty Ghost, like 
uh, I want to see a game like Black Ops 2 or Modern Warfare 2 both of them are a good card as a boots on the ground so hope you guys enjoyed let me know what type of cup did you want as a boots on the ground um, I hope you guys enjoyed thank you very much for watching and I'll see you guys on my next video peace